today is some more fox hair. Um, I'm at my parents' house, so I thought I'd do a really quick video. Um, here I have some Vietnamese noodles with some grilled um, pork and uh, grilled chicken. And this is really awesome. This is one of my favorite. This is, um, I think it's beef or pork wrapped in grape leaves. It's really good. It's also grilled on a bed of like bean sprouts and lettuce and um, noodles. So it's been kind of a hard day today. So I think I'm going to have a little beverage. says curious traveler I don't know where this cup came from but whatever oh. cheers to you guys I just wanted to say thank you for all my subscribers you guys have been um, really 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 supportive and so cheers thank you guys everyone's day today. I haven't been to my parents' house in a while. stories about home. I would always hear things at night when I was a kid, but my parents would always, um, brush it off so I wouldn't get scared, but every other night, I used to hear footsteps in the hallway in the middle of the night, like 3 o'clock in the morning, and um, everyone would be asleep because I would check. My mom used to um, have a sewing machine in the basement where she did some work at night sometimes, and one time, it was around 4 o'clock in the morning, she runs up and she comes into my room and she yells at me saying, I told you to go to sleep. Um, but I woke up at that point and she realized that I was sleeping. And I said, I, w 
wasn't sleeping. I wasn't um, up. I wasn't actually sleeping. What did you hear? And uh, my mom said she heard footsteps, but I think she didn't want to scare me, so she kind of played it off. years back, my dad was sleeping, and um, he felt something heavy on his chest, so he, when he opened his eyes, he saw a little girl dressed in white, in a white dress, hovering over her, and when he saw that, he screamed and ran out, and for like three months straight, he wouldn't sleep in that room without a light on. But now, if you ask him about that event, um, he actually denies it. He doesn't believe in ghosts. It's more so my mom and I. Don't judge me. Times are tough these days. 
Alright guys, I think I'm gonna end it here and finish this up later. <clears throat> Again, I just wanted to 